Yeah. Let's go. Let's go. Sadiq Bay. That's what I'm talking about. Sadiq Bay, 51 points, 10 rebounds. We about to talk about this. I see y'all inside. Every time on the front of a cab My G's for trees out of drop V Bit, 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 all right, Pistons fans, y'all already know what it is, man. I've been trying to tell y'all about Sadiq Bey for so long, man. Sadiq Bey just does not get the flowers I feel like he deserves. This man was all rookie. Um, you know, had a slow start to the season, then got really, really hot uh, when he needed to be. When we were missing a lot of players, man, showed y'all in the stretch how he could be consistent. And, you know, had a tough last couple of games. And what did the fan base do again? Turn their backs on him again. Like, dude, you know, just the disrespect from the beginning of, you know, the work ethic that he puts in, the way he transformed his game in one offseason to where he can attack the basket. He can get to the free throw line and do all of those things. And nobody gives his man the respect. Nobody. I, I don't I don't get it. I don't see it on a large enough scale where dudes give this man his flowers. I've been doing that. And this is why I've been doing that. Y'all look too far. Uh, close to what's happening right now y'all don't look you know towards the future enough you know what i'm saying i was looking towards the future this guy in the future two to three seasons this man is going to be something special you know what i'm saying sadiq bay and killian hayes uh not killian hayes uh k cuttingham special you hear me special together <laughs> together that's what i'm trying to get y'all to understand sadiq bay is just not a three and d guy that's just not what he is bro he was that when we drafted him sadiq bay is trying to take his game to next level you understand and tonight man you know it, it was i mean he gave you a plethora of things not just only from the three-point line um, he, he gave it to you in many ways tonight, <laughs> in many ways tonight, even if it got to the free throw line tonight. So, wow. Um, where do I start, man? Let's, let's dig into the stats. I guess, uh, we can go into the stats. Uh, first we're going to talk about, you know, uh, Bagley and Isaiah Stewart tonight. They were absolutely amazing tonight. Uh, Stewart, I wish he just would have had more points tonight, man, because in that first half he was, he was mad. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? That dunk had me hyped, man. Uh, but 16 points, man, 10 rebounds from him. And then you had 20 and 11 from Marvin Bagley. So, you know what I'm saying? When those two um, uh, do do things like that, it's going to make it a lot easier. Um, you know, Corey Joseph was pretty good while he was out there on the court, man. Three for four from three-point line. Um, and he was solid out there. Got to give it to him. Seven assists. Him saving Lee, K Killian Hayes, they were dishing tonight. Uh, Killian did go out with the... <clears throat> with the contusion from the uh, collision with his teammate, but he's fine. He was back on the bench. Um, he'd probably be ready for uh, next game or if anything, miss maybe one game. But um, yeah, ran head, uh, got hit in the jaw really, really hard. So I, I expect him to play next game. Best, best believe that. Um, but yeah, man, the bench, the bench was, I, it wasn't really needed like that tonight. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I mean, let's just be honest about it. <laughs> I mean, Sadiq Bay. Gave you 51, you know what I'm saying? So, I mean, they did enough. Uh, but like I said, Saban Lee was solid. Everybody on the team was positive and a plus minus, bro. So, you know what I'm saying? It's, oh, boy. <laughs> oh, boy. Let's see what type of media attention this game gets. Probably none. This was the only game available tonight to watch. Nobody else played tonight but the Pistons. I'm probably sure a lot of people was watching this game just because they have a thirst of watching basketball and there was nobody else playing. So, um, <laughs> kind of crazy to do that on this type of night. But tonight it was pretty much like a shut up moment for me. Um, you know, when I seen Sadiq Bay out there doing it, it, it was just like, you know, a be quiet moment to a lot of the doubters and the haters out there. And you know who you are, especially on my channel. I, I still got, uh, you know, the comments in my, my previous videos with y'all in there complaining. So y'all know I'm King Petty too. So you best believe I will be showing receipts. Um, but yeah, man, let's, uh, let's look at the stat line. 51 points, man. Three steals, four assists. 10 rebounds 
on what? 17 of 27 shooting. 17 of 27 shooting. 10 for 14 from the three-point line alone. 7 out of 10 from the free throw line, man. Sadiq Bay, absolutely amazing night. Pistons give you 134 points. Um, man, beautiful. Beautiful basketball, man. Definitely beautiful thing to watch. But like I said, this team next year is going to be ridiculous. We, we're about to go on a draft. I watched Gonzaga today. I will be um, following along with March Madness, and I will be dropping videos on those four individuals, being Banchero, Chet Holgram, uh, Jabari Smith, and uh, you know Ivy, man. I'll be... Uh, keeping up with those guys and I'll be dropping some videos after some of the some of those games today was the first round uh for Gonzaga you know they did what I thought they would do uh Chet almost had a triple double tonight yeah, I mean today um with seven blocks on top of his rebounds and points scored so uh but they they played a team that we expect them to beat and that's why I'm waiting to deck next round he has a, a real task next round and um you know, once I, I do my judgment on that, I'll drop his video. So, with that said, man, uh, like I said, Pistons was solid tonight, man. Pickett did get on the floor 18 minutes tonight. Didn't really do much. Uh, but, you know, plus 17 while he was out there when he scored two points. But, um, yeah, you know, the story of the night, Sadiq Bay, man. Sadiq Bay. Troy Weaver went and got Sadiq, man. He went and got Sadiq. He's seen what these other teams couldn't see. This is why, man, I keep telling y'all to have a GM that has vision. Vision, not short-term vision, not right now vision. This man is putting something together for the future for you and it's going to be good for a long time. Do you understand me? A long time. Y'all have to listen to me, <laughs> even though I know you won't because that's just what you do. But, um... Y'all got to listen to me, man. It's, man, let's let's be patient. You know what I'm saying? We got free agency and the draft. We're going to be fun next year. We're going to be really fun. And this team right now, nobody really wants to play us right now that's fighting for a playoff position because we are not just laying down. We're not just, bro, we, we was missing Kay Cunningham and Diallo Steele tonight. Steele. You know what I'm saying? And, you know, Orlando, yeah, they're a bad team. But we are not just doing this against bad teams. We're playing good teams like this. We're playing good teams like this. Playoff teams, contender teams that we're playing like this. Ever since the All-Star break, we're not, we not getting blown out by 20 no more. That's that's over with. You're going to beat us by, by five points. That's, that's, that's just what it is if you beat us. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So... You know, and it's beautiful to watch. You know what I'm saying? I'm so, so excited right now. Um, but Sadiq Bay, man, give that man his flowers and his respect because I can guarantee you if it was uh, Bagley or if it was Kay himself with 51 points right now, the entire internet would go plutonium right now <laughs> as far as Pistons fans right now. So I want to see that same excitement about Sadiq Bay because, like I said, I just don't think he gets the res the respect he deserves, man, because he's he's worked really hard, really hard on this game. And y'all got to give that man his flower. So with that said, man, let's enjoy the rest of this. I'm getting ready to hop on the stream with Sean and Half Court. And uh, make sure you guys check that out. And I'll see you guys. Uh, I'll see you guys next game. Peace.